Leanna Lou Perot, everyone. <laughs> Now, I wish when I was going to university we had these amazing fines for the dorm no room because things have gotten amazing for students right now that are going off to campus. Uh, and all of these things are so stylish but also very functional because you don't have a ton of space. And yeah. I, I always say just because you live, you're live, you living in a small space and for a lot of young adults, it's their first time living by, their cell, right. by themselves, that, you know, they, they want to show off a little bit of personality, mm -hmm. but the budget's not always there to do it. So yeah. I'm a big fan of one-stop shopping for big style. So I went to Walmart to pull all of these looks together. Yeah. So the, what I really wanted to show was two very important things when it comes to dorm room spaces and that's function yep. and showing off your personality. So I have two vignettes and this is really one that I wanted to point out some functional elements when you're moving in. So a little okay. bit more of a dude vibe here but I think one of the... <laughs> did Maybe. you get that? Yeah. A little bit. But I, I can which, totally which mom see. Which out, right? <laughs> the guy's like, Mommy I don't really it. care. <laughs> Black and white though, so classic. It can so go for classic. anybody. That's the thing it really is so bed in a bag well you need to think about mm. when you're moving in it's it's a lot about what you need but it's also about what you don't need okay. you need to find out online through a lot of the campuses they'll let you know what's already available if there's a desk and chair you don't need to bring those that's right, right. sometimes they don't like you bringing in bringing in extra pieces of furniture but you can get away with a little rolly cart like this now this is a great buy functional piece $22 at Walmart which was great now the key is when you're moving in pre-pack this or mom pre-pack this. Right. right? <laughs> Somebody so pre-pack it. It's not a case of bringing in the empty bin which is going to take room in the car and then a suitcase. Ditch the suitcase. Put all of the clothes and everything you need in here. You roll oh, it into smart. place. You're done. Packing yeah. is, is done. Unpacking is done. Good idea. Just like end of the bed. I'm a big fan of the under the bed containers. Mm -hmm. um, they just stash everything away. Now the key is like getting them into the container mm -hmm. takes a little bit of work instead of just one of the sweeping it under there but I find if the containers under there you can't sweep it forces the kids <laughs> to take it out and pack away right absolutely now when you're moving in again functional pieces this card on rollers this on rollers your laundry bin oh, so smart. easy to roll back home to parents house <laughs> to do the laundry right I was gonna say easy to roll down to the laundry room or to the laundry but yes room. you will bring that laundry home with you but again think functionally and pack smart and Instead of taking the um, empty laundry bin, pack oh, the two vacuum weeks of clothes seal. in a vacuum seal. I literally have five pairs of jeans, ten t-shirts, five sweaters, and some undies and socks and stuff in there really? too. Really? Right? So all of that, you open this up, it's going to let the air in, you can unzip it, and these were like easy, quick buys, the little Ziploc bags that you get oh, in the pack cool. of three. This is the small bag, and I fit all of that, and the pack comes with That's amazing. Bigger, bigger sizes. It really smooshes it in. Also, check the um, the size of the bed so you get the right bedding size. Such a good point. If they've got the beds there for you already, which they usually do if you're living in residence, uh, check the size, because you don't want to go there with, you know, queen size sheets, and it's a single bed but the, the duvet bed. and comforter I often say go a little bit bigger go a bit bigger right especially yeah. you can like you know burrito yourself in there yeah. nice and warm in the winter right after you, you pulled your all nighter studying exactly. absolutely and then functionality getting things off of the floor and onto the wall is always great message boards are great um, this I just have to point out this tape that I picked up from Walmart it's chalkboard, chalkboard tape. isn't that tape. fun Love so it. when we talk about adding a little bit of personality that's a great way to do it and moving in with crates I think everybody in the university days lived with crates but right have crates right they they became coffee tables, they became a little bit of everything, yes. but why not add some 3M hooks on the wall so uh -huh. you're moving in with this already packed and then this can just pop right on the wall. Oh, so and now classy. Okay, let's go over to our next room yes. now. We have another uh, beautifully stylish room, which is equally functional. I like the fact that what you've done with the walls is everything can come off without ruining the walls. Exactly. 3M, 3M hooks and tape yeah. was a big win for any dorm room because again, there's that element where you're not being, you're not allowed to paint the walls. You mm -hmm. can't screw in, put picture hangers. So everything has to be temporary style. Right. 3M allowed me to do all of this. And I think one thing is when you're shopping for dorm, shop various sections of the store. So when I was at Walmart actually stumbled into the kitchen department yep. and I thought I wanted to get jewelry. Is that a grater? 
a little zester. A little zester. For the earrings up there. That's awesome. A little bit of added function to the space. So That's the jewelry cute. itself can act as part of your art collection and you can do this kind of boho look. I use just some simple washi tape on the wall which again can come off easily when we're moving out. Yeah. And then again for me it was about the bedding. So this bedding, this set was only like under $50 which I was fantastic. I love this little, the, the little quilting. Well That's it's great. very sophisticated and I yeah. think so many times when kids are, are moving off they're not kids anymore. Mm -hmm. They want to be a little bit more sophisticated so going with that ground and gray color is fabulous. But then of course have some fun with the coverlets. You can go with that little boho look and when we talk about fun of course you know, <laughs> you know me I love a little bit of quirk and this was one of my top picks. This actually comes in sets of two these pillowcases. So the one is I woke up like this <laughs> which <laughs> isn't most days for me. Do not wake up like this. And then hello gorgeous because oh, who doesn't need cute. like a little bit of fun. A right? little pick me up especially day, when right? you have a lecture on Monday morning at 8.30 a.m. Right or you're stumbling in at 3 yes. o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. Hello, hello gorgeous. gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> right, you definitely need that You've reminder. got the desk here, the rolly chair, task lights, all of the things you're going to need but I love the packing tips especially because it's brutal that first pack going up there with the, with, sure. the with the van and you're trying to shove as many things in as possible. Well and, and don't forget you don't need to take everything with you. You don't. There's one stop shop centers like a Walmart that you can go yeah. to the one close to campus and get what you need. So it might be a case of doing a tally and doing your checklist a little bit once you move it. You yeah. know you're going to need bedding. You know you're going to need like the necessities. Right. But things like the like little mini fridge. Are you allowed to have one? If you are, run out and pick one up. Is that and a mini works. fridge over it there? It is a little mini That's fridge. That's a very a smart bit of idea. Washi tape on there as well. Mm -hmm. So double duty as a nice little side table. Nice. So it's again thinking practical. Yeah. But not being afraid to add a little bit of style. Yes. Right. And on a budget.